to the Philippines and welcome to the boss, Mario Malo. Welcome to the, welcome. Thank you so much. How has it been so far here in the Philippines? It's a um, very surprise and very exciting for me because it's my first time here in the Philippines. The only way I talk to them is on the Twitter. You actually personally respond to the tweets of your fans here in the Philippines? Yeah, yeah, of course. But oh. sometimes that's tweet me in Tagalog, so I don't Tagalog. understand. <laughs> what yeah. words do you understand in Tagalog? Right now it's Mahao Kukayo. Oh, can you tell your fans that? Yeah, Mahao Kukayo. Oh. <laughs> What's your normal day like for you in Thailand? Usually I go skateboarding because I skate since I'm, I'm a kid. I fix old cars like Volkswagen because it's like my hobby. I do it with my friends. I grew up in the city of Bangkok. Usually I have many friends in, in my childhood. I just playing only skateboard and mm -hmm. my dad just told me that why you play skateboard? Why don't you go like tennis or golf? Okay. That make you more money or something like that. Uh, okay. But I say no, it's not fun that. Yeah. But I heard that your brother's also in the entertainment business mm -hmm. as a rapper. Yes. Um, do you also rap or sing? No, I just help him sometime when he go to a concert. He just bring me up. I go with him. Um, you write songs? No, he write. We we both have the same same feeling about it. we like songs we like rap songs hip hop songs since we are shy we are happy to listen to it mm -hmm. but he 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 have a he have a talent to write songs and sing sa lahat ng pagsisikap at paghihirap ni Mario bago niya makamit ang tagumpay tanging ang pamilya ang kanyang nagsilbing inspirasyon the big truth first on the bus one of the reasons you joined the entertainment industry is because to help your family. Yeah. How important is your family to you? Very important, but because um, I'm, I grew up with my family. My mom is, have a gas station, and the only thing I do when I'm a boy is filling gas. Oh, so you were mm. a gas boy? Yeah, I'm gas boy. <laughs> I'm only running around in the gas station doing everything for the cars, vacuum the car, the car clean the car, Feel the gas, feel the air on the tires or something like that. What would you say was your hardest struggle that you went through growing up? This should be when my, my dad passed away. Oh, really? I'm yeah. sorry to hear about that. When okay. did he pass away? About three years ago. Because of? Because of he has a diabetes. How did this affect your life? It's, um, I get a shock because my career is coming up mm -hmm. and I just finished my first movie, or second movie only, mm -hmm. and then, uh, but it's lucky he, he, he got to watch Love of Sam. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I, I opened it and uh, showed him. He, he says very good. And Let's talk about your movie, The Love of Siam. Yeah. This was a big break for you. You became an instant star. Mm -hmm. This is where you portrayed the role of a gay. Yeah. When the role was offered to you, were you hesitant? Yeah, of course. Mm -hmm. Because I'm 100% I'm, I'm a man. But, but I think that the role of uh, the gay in a movie is, mm -hmm. is, uh, is it's in a good way. It's not like something that's going to teach people to be a gay or something like that. It's, it's like it's a normal life of people. So what made you say, yes, I want to do this movie? My friend told me, like, you should think about your family because your mom worked hard for a very long time. So I should, it's a good, good opportunity for me. So I just, okay, I try. But for your fir first movie, that's amazing. You won an acting award right away. Would you say that this is what you want to do for the rest of your life? No. And you're enjoying your time as an actor now? I have to tell you first, because when I do this Love of Sam, I'm, I never learned acting before. And uh, I just do it. Only thing in my, my mind is I just want to find some money for my mom and my, my family. So I don't know what is acting. I just do follow everything that my director told me. Like. People want to know in the Philippines if you think that maybe there's a chance that you can fall in love with a Filipina. Yeah, the Filipina girls are very beautiful. Very beautiful. Yeah, and and even people here are very nice to me. We'll be doing a movie now with Erich Gonzalez. So tell us about your movie. Erich yesterday. Yeah, and she's very fun, very play playful. And the movie is. Uh, it's going to be shoot in Bangkok, uh, in Thailand, and in the Philippines. I know her because uh, she come work in Thailand, okay. and and my friend got to meet her, and she, she and, and we heard that she's going to be playing with me. So but my friend says she's very nice and very funny girl. Well, I have some fast talk questions for you that we will yeah. run through, and please answer this first. Okay, your favorite movie? The Forest Gump. Favorite sleepwear? Just wear a t-shirt and a box. First thing you do when you wake up? First thing I do. I
brush my teeth. You brush your teeth, and the last thing you do before you sleep? Before I sleep, I take out my contact lens. What's the sexiest part of my body? Should be my chest because I work out. Mm -hmm. Three things that you love in a girl. Three things is uh, fun mm -hmm. and sweet and um, clever. What is love for Mario? What is love? Mm -hmm. How would you define love? How I define love? Love is like it's like the air. Air? Why? Because you cannot see it, but you cannot live without it. You think it's not uh, it's not like uh, important, but you need it all the time. Now, well, Mario, thank you so much. We enjoyed having you here on the bus. And of course, what message would you like to give for all your Filipino fans here in the Philippines? Uh, thank you very much for your warm welcome and. Just please support me. I will come to Filipina in, to Philippines and work here. So thank you so much for your support. I love you. In Tagalog? In Tagalog, mahal ko kayo. Oh, <laughs> very good. All right. Maraming maraming salamat at swadika. Okay. <laughs>